What's up everyone, this is Control. Today we are going to be playing Westport Independent. Uh, basically it's a game where uh, you're deciding what gets censored or not. I guess you're like the government, Chinese government or something, I don't know. Uh, uh, I kind of get the feeling it's kind of like um, Papers, Please or the Robot Limb Station, kind of like that. You got to decide based on the manual what to do and whatnot. This book contains your guidelines for independent papers until the dismantlement of all non-government owned papers takes place due to the public culture bill that comes into force on 6th of May 1936. Drag a paper to the desk to read it, censor improper content. When you're done censoring, put the paper in the print envelope. If an article shouldn't be run at all due to lack of proper content, Put it in the deny envelope. The loyalist government expects your cooperation and hopes you understand the consequences of disobedience and or affiliation with disloyal members of the public. To close this book, please drag it to its place between the typewriter and the ashtray. Notes. The bars to the right illustrate two things. The white bar shows how much of the public are sympathizing with the rebels. The dark bar shows the loyalist suspicion of you. All right, let's get the fucking work. More and more people are losing their jobs. About 20% of the population don't have jobs. 34% of the working population don't make enough to... Ah, oh, just trash that shit. Deny! A small riot was started in the southern docks yesterday. The rioters smashed windows and set fire to trash cans. Police arrived to stop the vandalism, but were attacked by the rioters. Backup soon arrived and the riot was stopped. Eight people were arrested. Man, that seems good. Man, that's fucking that's fucking honest news right there. Print that shit. Westport State Prison planned to admit twice as many prisoners by 1940. This is possibly due to the smaller cells that have been constructed for the last few months. The Loyalist governments expect that this will make the maintenance of prisoners both easier and cheaper. I just censor all that fucking shit. I don't even know. I, I don't know, like, just leaving that that one part doesn't even seem, doesn't seem like a whole paper. <laughs> Fight the power. The president has visited a tent. Oh, yeah, that's good news. The schools were private schools funded by member. I don't know about that. The president taught the children about politics and what it's like. Yeah, print that shit. A new bill has passed that will make sure cinemas only show government approved material. The bill will come into force the June the 17th. The government will create an institution that will be responsible for examining movies when they're sent to cinemas. And that whole thing is relevant. Leave it. Fuck, I said leave it. Take that shit over there and print it. Police raided a small rebel headquarter last night. 14 people were arrested. Four were shot while resisting arrest. Huh, let's, let's throw that shit away. Denied! We're pretty even. We're like the middle of the ground newspaper. The current teaching materials used in schools are outdated and incorrect, says the education minister. Knowing about your education is important, so I'm going to leave it in there. All teaching material will be replaced with more up-to-date. That's good stuff, right? Right? Yep. All new material will be examined by government officials to make sure they're proper and relevant. That's totally not fucking suspicious in the least, but hey, print that shit. A police car was set on fire in the old residential area, the southern docks. The fire was soon put out by the officers using the car. Did they put out the fire using the car? <laughs> that's pretty... That, that's, that's fucking amazing. Who had left it temporarily. That, that's fucking amazing. No one has was injured during the fire. No one has been arrested for the incident. The police are suspect local rebels. Shit, that's good news. I can't... Oh man, I can't, I can't fucking lie about that. Ten people have been reported missing. The missing people were suspected of being part of the rebel groups in the southern docks. People say they've begun investigating and have no further comments. It shouldn't matter. People are people, dog. People are people. 
Huh, they might be a little bit suspicious of me after that week. 28 people arrested after protesting. The protesters were protesting against the upcoming public culture bill. Took part in the riot. Protesters soon stopped after the police. Ah, I have to scribble that out. Oops. No, I don't know. Ooh, I don't even know what I just denied. <laughs> Broken windows and paint smeared on walls in southern suburbs. Messages like, down with the government. Freedom for the people. Written in red paint. Rebel group suspected. Yeah, protection. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm so balanced. A bombing took place, bombing, not banning, took place in the southern docks last night. Four people were injured, two people died, police suspects local rebel group. Yeah, that's good news right there. Who cares who the police suspect? A new park is planned for Westwood. That's beautiful. I love parks. Parks and recreation. No activities. The park will be built in the old residential areas by the side. You mean the ones that got bombed earlier? And the car set on fire? You're going to build a park there? Currently, around 400 people live in the apartments that will be demolished to make room for... Oh, mm -mm -mm. That's not important. People don't need places to live. They can sleep on the park benches. A man was shot during a robbery in North Westport. The robber was alone and had his face covered by a black mask. Police suspect local rebel group. Four people have been arrested. Yeah, yeah, print that shit. Plus eight, plus two, uh. One week, let's go all out, guys. All out, slander. New statistics show that the amount of street street beggars is lower than it's ever been. Beggars have gotten fewer since the police have was given free hands. Damn, that's some bad grammar. The hands to handle handles issues regarding public appearance. Witnesses have reported seeing officers harassing beggars until they either run away or been arrested. Eh, that's that's good. So scratch that out. Yep, print that. Fucking, let me, thank you. The quality of medical care has improved greatly over the last few months, according to a new study. Oh, that's good. The quality of medical services have gone up since the hospital administration fees was doubled earlier this spring. Uh, the study was made by the government medical, yep. Print that shit. The rebuilding of the Westport Public Library is finished. The new library will be named the Loyalist Library. The books will be hand-picked by the government officials. Improper books will be... See, yep, that's, that's fucking perfect. Why can't I pull it up here? That doesn't fucking make any sense. Print. Hell yeah. They don't even know. They don't even know. The 18th of May has arrived. The public culture bill is now in force and the Westport Independent has been dis dismantled. Now that the loyalist government controls the media, most of the rebels have either been silenced or fled the country. No one really knows what will happen next, but it's pretty certain that there won't be any uprising against the loyalists anytime, again anytime soon. Well, that's lame. Let's, let's play one more round, guys. Because that's lame. Click, click. Fuck, I'm, I'm clicking. How many times do you want me to fucking click? Guys. Okay. Let me try and refresh the page and see what happens. Clearly. You're only meant to play the game once. It installs a cookie of death on your Westport Independent and just destroys it every time you click on it. Because I cannot, for the life of me, get it. I've clicked anywhere to begin. It, it worked perfectly fucking fine before. So I guess that's it for this video, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Peace.